All right, all systems go. About to shoot that. Black. And turn that into a nice pretty motor. We're well, about ready to hit it. Got the system set up. It's gonna match the black. It's got some gold highlights. Yamaha. We'll see. We'll see it. Let's go rock and roll. Turns out all systems weren't go. My paint on the head didn't stick so when I was polishing the fins paint was chipping so I'm uh, going to tape all this up and sandblast just the head with a little sandblaster the question is how do you keep sand out of your ports and here's the answer. That's half of a tailor-made golf ball. And I'm gonna silicone them over the ports. Just like that. On the intake and the exhaust and in addition <laughs> to that get, uh, which by the way if you're ever going to cut a golf ball in half make sure you have a good vise and a sawzall those are all be screwed in to the back of them like that so I can pull them out easy man you're talking about upsetting this is upsetting and it all goes back to the fella that did my machining work did a half ass paint job on the head fortunately he didn't paint the cylinders so they didn't, they didn't chip. Everything else was going to be good, but the head paint just didn't stick. So we'll see how it comes out. If not, I'll buy another freaking motorcycle. I'd call that a par four. Huh. That's got to be plugged. All right, that's how I'm gonna keep getting sand in my ports. Man, can't believe I actually have to do this, but I have to do this. This is what you have to go through when you paint a head on top of messed up paint and I thought I prepared this properly but apparently I left some degreaser on it I don't know but this is a mess that's a brand new machined head and here I am having to pull the whole thing apart and spray it down with paint stripper and hope I don't I'll probably just have to take it back to the machine shop let them look it over I don't know messed up I know that round two completely stripped this, rinsed it, washed it, stripped it, washed it, applied prep 
metal prep POR, POR 15 metal prep that goes with the paint I put on it originally. Put my golf balls back over the ports, intake and exhaust ports. So we we'll give that about 30 minutes and then I'm going to spray it again and then polish off the fins, edges, and those lines there. Uh, this is as clean as it's going to get, I think. And with that metal prep, it should stick, should have good paint finally. Mm -hmm.